Hi Pisces, your weekly day by day, tarot cards reading by M for the week beginning on Monday the 21st of October. So Monday the 21st with a Two of Swords, secretive energy, um, unsure, insecure, fearful somehow. Wait with the magician. Oh, it seems to me it's your secret. You're not fearful, you're not fearing, because you were with this energy, with magician's energy, which says now that what you have on your mind, that what you are planning to do, you can do easily. Okay, you've got everything. Magician does have everything. If you needed money, you've got money. If you need resources, if you need help, if you need good idea, whatever that you need, you've got it. I mean, you've got your talent to execute it. It's suitable for you. Now it's easy. For you, now it's easy. Since you brought yourself here since you've got this idea oh it's easy you're gonna execute it chop chop that's for you nothing you just don't want to talk about that maybe some new idea um, about business about career and you don't want people to steal your idea maybe something like that but you are not definitely talking about uh, this idea you're not talking about what you are creating now Perhaps you don't want to jinx it. You don't want people to sabotage you. You don't want to. You don't want people to take this idea at, as theirs. Okay, to steal your idea. But you do have a grandest idea. Maybe something for your business. For the I don't know, making money or so. And you don't want to talk about that. You keep it secret because it's going to be so lucrative. You can make it. You can make big business out of it. You can make big career out of it. You can make something with this. Okay, but you. Are keeping it quiet shush nobody to know in that sense your Monday Tuesday with the Hierophant now look this could be um, advisor okay maybe somebody who's supposed to tell you what to do how to do some advice maybe you are receiving from this person um, maybe some social norms, we can talk social norms, we can talk a group of people, could be religious group, group you belong to, okay, maybe it's a group of engineers, okay, and you are belonging, you are sharing your ideas with this group, but maybe your marriage uh, also stands for marriage, let me pair it first. Um, the Queen of Pentacles, oh, look, this is your business mind. This is something which you want to ground. You're going to make it certain. I really believe you are asking. You will be asking somebody for advice because you want to ground it. You want this to make money. You want this to be recognized, to work, okay? You want it for certain. You don't want to experiment. Surely you want it grounded, rooted. And to stay. This is energy which likes security, stability, safe income, safe place. You see what I'm saying? And you are searching for it. Now, through another person, okay, some good advisor, person you trust to tell you exactly how you're gonna go about it, or just you being faithful, trusting yourself. This is also faith, believing in, believing in yourself, believing in your idea, believing in your talent that you can execute, you can make this happen, you can ground this business, you can make this idea work for you. This is something which works for you, brings results. Whatever that results is, um, whatever intention that you have, that what you intend to have, whether that's money or some success or some popularity or whatever that is, you can have it, you trust yourself self okay often with the hierophant we know exactly when things gonna happen when you're gonna receive this first money when something will be done and finished will show end results often as i said the hierophant says it's going to be on the first of january in that sense you know exactly something and that why you are trusting yourself you are believing in yourself because you know exactly that it's going to happen and when very certain energy, whether that's somebody advising you or you were believing in yourself. But this is what is important, that what you were after. This is grounded, safe place, something which earns, something which brings that end result. That's your end result. And you were holding on to it. You will have it, you know when. In that sense, this Tuesday.
Wednesday with Ace of Cups. Not beautiful Ace of Cups. We love these Aces. <laughs> opportunity to make yourself happy, to do something which you really love. Opportunity to, for, for love, for, for uh, friendship could also mean something like that. But happiness, definitely on offer, definitely possible. Um, Four of Swords says you need some time for it. Maybe you don't feel well on this day, okay? And there is um, opportunity to heal it. On this day, perhaps you are attending something which was um, um, your physical problem, maybe some headaches that you did have lately or you did have some allergies or you did have, I don't know, some backache. You've got solution for it and you've got permanent solution. Um, Ace of Cups brings permanent solution for some illness for something which bothered you physically um, lately but could be just a moment which you need to take for yourself okay there is great opportunity you know when you're going to have this you know when you're gonna you know succeed nothing to stand on your way there's magician there's queen of, of pentacles you will have it and you know when and you know that opportunity for you to be happy to have something which you're really looking forward to okay is a certain for you you just need some time to rest relax to maybe meditate to give yourself some time to recuperate in a way it's maybe hard work supposed to follow maybe you were working hard some of these days maybe some mental work not just physical work but you need perhaps some time just to rest to recuperate and then to start anew from um, the very next day, the very next week or so. But this is your guide, that happiness, that opportunity for you to make your happy life, okay, something which you really love, opportunity is there, it's certain, I think certainty stands within you for it. Um, so yeah, just rest, relax and continue from tomorrow. Thursday. Four of Swords again. Yeah, look, could be that you are um, a bit sickish. Could be that you need some answers. Let me pair it, in fact. Two of Cups. Um, look, if we are talking illness, definitely you are healing yourself. You are on the right path. It's going to take a couple of days, a couple of more days, or I don't know, a couple of weeks, but you are healing something. Could be if you are healing something, you are on the right path. You've got solution. You will heal it. You are very happy self. You are very balanced, very trusting self. You just need to lay in the bed and take some time. It will heal. If it's about healing. Now, could be that you are searching for some sort of solution, some sort of decision, some sort of clarity, maybe timing, some sort of timing, when. And that's what you are looking to specify because something's supposed to be specified, something's supposed to be said, something's supposed to be clear. Thinking about that one particular detail, okay, you are working on it, some sort of detail, very, very important detail, maybe, as I said, related to timing. You are working on it, you have to seriously think about that. Maybe that's the case this Wednesday, Thursday. But then, look, I didn't even mention that here on uh, Wednesday. Could be offer of love. Could be new relationship possible. Could be that you saw somebody which you really like. And you were thinking, should you approach that person? Should you not? What should you do? Maybe somebody approaches you. There is offer of love. Somebody is coming towards you. Somebody likes you. Very romantic energy, this Ace of Cups. Could be just something like that. Very romantic possibility for the relationship. Because there's two of cups on the very next day and you were thinking about that first perhaps you got surprised maybe you were hurt lately lately maybe you did have problem with the relationship lately and now it seems something else is coming something beautiful something exceptional something romantic possibility for the relationship possibility for love very present here but you were seriously thinking should you should you not I don't know why so much of thinking, I kind of think because of these three swords hung on the wall because of something which offended you, something which hurt you lately. You are holding back. You are not uh, rushing towards this love, towards this relationship. You are very, very cautious. But relationship, possible relationship, love offer, okay, present here, very, very possible. 
these two days but you were the very same thing you're still thinking about that you are still not sure you are still not saying things particularly here you are keeping quiet on Thursday you will switch your telephone off you don't have answer you cannot talk you cannot answer you cannot you have to think about this relationship about this offer what to do with that seems nice seems fine you would love it but you're not gonna say it yet could very well be just offer of love which you are currently right now you are not prepared for came suddenly surprised you okay and you don't know what to do anyway that's your Thursday Wednesday Thursday very similar with the Ten of Cups. Now we love this Ten of Cups because it talks about happiness. These are two hands celebrating future, future together. Maybe you want to travel somewhere. Maybe you're going to buy something. But this is happiness which you are seeing possible for yourself. Maybe you have decided, okay, I'll give it a chance. This relationship does have chance. Relationship with this person might make me happy. Could be something like that. But something definitely could make you happy. That's Ten of Cups stand for. A relationship or, I don't know, career, business, money, doesn't matter. But something could make you happy. You've got big hopes. You've got big expectations. I will be happy with this person, with this job, with this career, if I travel or something. The Hierophant again trying to be wise, trying to believe, and being that represents unity, okay, maybe you were just believing in this relationship, this something new from Wednesday, offer came, person came, something very romantic, offer of love, and then you are on Friday, with your decision to go for it, you are trusting this unity, this relationship, it does have a possibility to stay, to be um, committed relationship, to be loving relationship to make you happy you see what I'm saying does have future both of them are talking about future life together that's decision perhaps here that you can make life with this person trusting relationship formed on this day you see what I'm saying trusting future with this person it, it's just like that you're trusting future with this person if we are a following relationship offer of love or so but now look we do have the hierophant here on Tuesday as a believer as a trusting yourself trusting your decision trusting this idea your new life which you are creating which you are making certain this stability which you are are making for yourself you see what I'm saying now could be just extension of this Tuesday now you know yes this career will blossom this business will blossom this what you were starting here will blossom that's what you know here you believe that on Tuesday but on Friday you know it for sure it opens up for you yes future is bright for you with this business career this employment could be also something like that it doesn't necessarily mean um, doesn't necessarily mean relationship could go many ways but still but still this energy ten of cups is a fairy tale energy huge massive expectations happily ever after you and that person you met on a Wednesday you with this business with this new career you see what I'm saying happily ever after you know you're certain about that you strongly believe in this what you are having here on Friday strongly believe it will happen very tale, as I said, very lovely, in fact, very happy energy Friday. Saturday with a strength. I don't like strength energy. It's always, you know, for you to put effort to subdue your feelings for some reason. So when you have to subdue your feelings for whatever reason, it's always a bit heavy. And I'm going to pair it now. With the lovers this is a strong relationship if we are talking new relationship love relationship oh this one will last okay this one 
will last forever definitely this is something meant to be worth fighting for worth putting effort into you see what i'm saying if you are talking relationship you pisces you are this time on the right path this is the right person for you this is your soulmate so that's it go for it in that sense perhaps if we were talking relationship but the same time we can talk your new idea your new um your new path in life okay your new way of doing business showing yourself out there earning money you see what i'm saying but in the same very way okay this is your way now you know on this day everything is proved to you stay there stay course that's your right way that's your right business that's your right career that's your right person you see what i'm saying just confirmation not just any sort of confirmation this is certainty this is compulsory you have to have this person this career this business this is meant for you could also talk about um, business partnership okay this too but that strong business partnership where you are uh, complementing your skills your talents okay you do have your talent you do have your skill you've got some knowledge that another person does have skill talent knowledge for something else and it's perfect combination for some sort of business for some sort of career money making you see what i'm saying perfect combination two of you are perfect couple um, perfect relationship love relationship uh, perfect business partnership this is perfection two of you complementing each other could be just your career okay your decision to go after something which is so suitable for you something which just came to your mind and you come to the point that you can execute it this is only way this is perfect way to make you happy to earn you money to secure your life you see what i'm saying perfection by all means go for it whatever this week pisces whatever that's this week whether that you are doing new business whether that you have idea about business about career about your studies about your home about person whatever that came to your mind on the monday and it seems fantastic seems suitable seems great okay go for it it will work magic for you it will work perfection for you you see what i'm saying this is perfection cannot be better things are just adding perfectly to each other from friday into saturday they are adding they are complementing they are working with each other in a perfect way okay just stay there it's your way it's your person it's your career it's your business that what you're supposed to follow it's so strong it's so lovely now your sunday with nine of cups yeah just what you wished for you've got all that you worked for all that you wanted yeah you've got it you've got it here by saturday i think by friday <laughs> rest of it is just acknowledgement just in a different way just confirmation beautiful beautiful week for you yeah you're gonna celebrate perhaps on this day you might call people, you know, you prepare some food, some drinks, and you call people and you tell them what you are after, that you people are together, that you have started this business. This is something for your life. This is something meant to be. This is something to make you happy, to bring you money. This is something, okay, something serious, something important, something you're surely not going to lose, and you will call people on Sunday. This is drinks, food, um, I don't know enjoyable time okay and perhaps with people with your best friends and not many people but couple of friends you're gonna call you will enjoy you will tell them what you are after what is happening to you this is a great news this is your wish come true okay this is that sort of news my wish is coming true people come around let's celebrate you will celebrate i really love this something major like i don't know what a major you've got your i don't know love of your life you've got a business of your life something for your life okay opens up here and you know it you know it you are celebrating it enjoy it eh anyway pisces i really hope that you're gonna enjoy it and i will speak to you again very soon till then best regards there by m